Yo, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a new, uh, new uh, battle replay of Napoleon Total War, Napoleonic Total War 3 mod. Uh, this is my first ever PvP, and I'm uh, gonna play like the Netherlands. Uh, this is my first PvP, it's a 4v4, and this time I'm playing against Kingston. He is deployed down here, so here in the back. He's playing like Italy. Um, this battle was played during the live stream of Kingston. His live stream is gonna be. He gonna try to stream weekly, and that's gonna be on a Saturday. So if you wanna see me live, be sure to check out Kingston's live stream. Maybe you won't see me play because I'm on the other team, like now, but we will see it then. Um, the armies are just quite simple. You have the Dutch army, the Hanover, the army of Hanover, and two Austrian armies. On the other side, we have a French army, a Bavarian army, and two Italian armies in the back. But before, uh, I'm in the deployment zone because of the first PvP battle and I want to announce Kingston. But, um, uh, that, that's actually why I was here and I want to do say something. So I'm gonna say now some. Now I'm gonna say something and I will see you back when the battle has begun. Okay guys, I just wanna remind you that when I hit the 50 subs, I couldn't release in Discord. And now we're less than 20 subs away from the dis from the Discord. So if you're new here, here and you didn't subscribe on me yet, do it now and make sure you'll help us to reach the 50. And now, let's go to the battle. Okay, the battle has begun. I've paused the game because it's fast-paced battle. Because Austria is down here. The French already around this house. We're gonna play for points, so the French, they have this house. Already from the beginning and most of the battle will be around here. Like you see, this Austrian army is gonna move up. This Austrian army is gonna try to go here. Go here. I'm more like I'm gonna try to be more in the center. And Hanover, he's gonna move his troops uh, on the right flank. I staged the cannon down here. That's gonna shell. Already start to shell. Quite good because it's twelve. It's in twelve pounder and it is range. A little further than this uh, community, so like here somewhere is the range. So let's play. <laughs> Austria is gonna try to set in defensive position with his artillery up the hill. Well, the other Austrian army is trying to re get up here. France is just doing France, he's gonna take the house. A Vega who deployed here gonna move around, gonna try to shift his troops to uh, this side. I took the house with a militia force. This house was on the back of my deployment zone, I couldn't reach it, so I just sat in the militia units here, the National Milici. And I'm just gonna let them go in the building. I asked Hanover if they could pass nearby in case and the enemy was trying to take it. My my artillery found a target. Okay, I like this and uh, the sun effects. I really do. And now he's focusing down.
Horses still in the horses? I think he was. I don't know if he's just, ma just marching up. From the moment I saw the Bavarian general in range, I gave my artillery the order to try to snipe him. The earlier we get rid of a general, the better. French, the French have set up their artillery aiming on the Austrians, who are taking casualties. The French are preparing a defensive line around this house. So at the moment, Austria is doing everything alone and I'm just sitting a bit here, doing really actually nothing. I'm transferring units, trying to go around my artillery to the back over here because it's a big open zone. Uh, and also, I gonna use some material of the some stream footage to see what the others are doing and how they react on things. Are they differently react on things? Like the Italian uh, generals. Uh, this is Kingston's uh, army. And this this army is Kingston. Uh, well, this general is Kingston's army. The from King's army, you can't see his army yet. <laughs> and Bavaria is trying to scout out our position. So I used one of my cavalry units, my uh, Lancers. I'm trying to, uh, to scare his forces off. And I've uh, noticed it, and he's gonna send over his uh, cavalry units. His general is with him. This building has fallen to the enemy. And the enemy took this house. You can already see most of the battle will be fought around here. All the Austrian cavalry arrived and France is shifting over troops. This Austrian army is just kind of sitting back, trying to form up on the hill. I have some troops that I gonna station, gonna set here just to make sure there's not really a gap in between us. My main military, my main force. I'm shifting over. And over arrived with his first troops, but still not not really things to see. And TW3 is kind of slow pace in the beginning. Oh, <laughs> uh, what artillery was that? I thought this was Italian artillery. Yeah, this was Italian, uh, Italian artillery. <laughs> I think it was Kingston's artillery. He won't like it. I don't think so. And this, this side's gonna be more like uh, horse bluffing. On this side, it's gonna be on the other side. It's more like who's gonna do the first first move. And I broke Italian cavalry. <laughs> hey, oh, like I said in the beginning, my twelve pounder, perfectly placed.
Sorry guys for the little uh get in there. I had to recharge my battery. I'm now trying to shell the Bavarian general. Byron? I think you said like that in German? The Byron general? I have to say, you have Bavaria and Bavarian beer. Bavarian beer is good. And it, all the Italian army arrived, and I thought they had horizons. Yeah, they have horizons. Horizons just arrived in time and start to shell the French position. And you can see that they formed around the house a defensive line. We don't see everything yet of the French army. And also not of the Bavarian army, so they did a good job. During the play, during playing this game, the uh, graphics were set on medium because otherwise the game would be unplayable for everybody. So I will see, will see things that I didn't saw during the game, like the massacre, just a death littered over the floor. Fresh artillery is moving up. Austrian cavalry arrived on scene. Only one French cavalry unit to respond. And now we're starting to see more uh, Byron Kev. I tried to gonna say the names in the native language if possible. Hanover has arrived and it's really starting to bluff. So Hanover and Bavaria are gonna bluff each other for an entire time. I'm just more like gonna scout my cavalry units. I yeah, I wanna say I do cavalry units. My my light dragoons. Okay, I never know what dragoons were in German, but dragoons sounds better in English and in Dutch. To, we are doing a bit of damage to the French lines. <laughs> I think I, s I snapped one person of the Bavarian general. It's not a general, but I killed at least one person. The Italian general coming up. During this game, I was playing on both sides of the of the battlefield. I was playing on uh, the the Austrian side and playing on the German side because Bavaria. I call this the Aust German side for now because Hanover and German both uh, are both German states. Uh, Hanover and Bavaria are both German states, and here we just two Austrian armies. And now we can see the Bavarian have moved the troops over. I don't think I killed someone from them. No, I don't see any bodies here. Ah, it's a shame. Wait, I... Maybe I killed one or two dudes of them. I saw so one body, body there. Just going over the units, maybe I can find some damage I did. No, the shoots are all healthy.
where artillery is still shelling the enemy position. And there's still troops moving down here. Or, it's, or it are the Italians. Hanover's uh, army is infantry has arrived. So that's already good. Yeah, it's really slow pacing, it's really more like laughing in the beginning. But from the moment the battle starts, it's. It is worth it. Oh, ho, ho. French are getting shelled. Then they're standing here like they don't care. And then you get. I hope you saw it in the beginning, but then you get some flying Frenchmen. Wait, where is from the house? They were from. There were four men, fl four men flying out of the house. What? I never saw that happening. We see the first Italian cavalry units. So that means that both Italian armies are close. Hanover is trying to set up a defensive position. Okay, all walking on one line. The uh, Feldjäger. I think there those are skirmishers. I'm not sure. Just go move the battlefield, you see already the horses. Just horses spread around. And the battle didn't even start yet, it's just the begin stage bluffing. The Eastern main army force still marching up. My cavalry units, my light dragoons. Also standing proud and shut up. My light dragoons are standing proud, waiting for their orders. My horse still I was looking for a good place on the hill to set them up. And like you can see, I set my uh, Dutch units more down here to protect the flank of Austria because Austria is now moving up. Both options are moving up, so the attack has started. Okay, I was thinking, what the fuck are those Brian things in between the infantry? Uh, Tower of horses. You can see a long line of French and Bavarian units. French until all oh, really one guy gave massive blood loss, but French until is shelling the Austrians. I'm just actually standing by with my military, not doing much with them. Uh, Austria asked me to kind of protect the flank for incoming cavalry charge and I'm moving up some infantry units to protect the artillery. I'm really, I'm really new, this is really my first PvP game ever, so I'm not that good. Hanover is still marching up on the road. Uh, Bavarian and Italian care really close. So all uh, Bavarian cavalry is on 
Spain side, the German side, and the Austrian side is all the Bavarian infantry. The Italian Kev, I thought it was Kev from Hanover. I would now want to say a good flanking action. Never mind. Here are the Jaegers of Hanover standing prompt. They are going to take a shot. Okay. I hope they should form a very nice bat the volley, but not really. They're taking down some horses, some Lancer cavalry from Bavarian. You really start to see just some bodies, some random bodies down here that are just catch these off my artillery with my 12 pounder. I like the new effects of the artillery. They're really the kind of shockwave, if you say so. Really nice. Austria is slowly moving up. Artillery is opening. I'm limbering my. Oh, I'm setting my artillery into place. I have a 10 a 6 pounder artillery. Trying to support the uh, 10 pounder. Now we start to see Italian infantry. Uh, Italian lights are this. I actually have to think what they were. I already killed some Italians. I killed them all. I killed them by having horses. You saw the person flying. Okay, really? I just killed the horse here. Oh my god. Oh, first engagement, and it seems that Austria has won. Nicely done. Also tried to do and try to take out the French artillery, but they failed because France sent in, sent in one cavalry unit. I unlimbered my artillery, but are they able to shoot for me or not? I'm not entirely sure. Just run straight to the cannon. Sure, the cannon is just air shooting air, not the not the entire cannon or so. But nothing is happening. Now the Austrian flank is very exposed. I. Wasn't really focusing on this side of the map that much, I was more focusing on the other side. Austria is moving up again. Oh, that was a deadly shot. Some Austrian hussars. That's at least just ripping holes in the lines and the cavalry. I don't know really what to say because the battle didn't really start yet.
Hanover is still marching up, like not like there's nothing there. My artillery has arrived on spot, so I'm able to set them in defensive positions from the moment I notice them. I don't know why I set up troops down here. I don't remember that. I don't remember why. I know I did, but I don't remember why. I have just uh, Grenadiers, Line Infantry and Belgian Jaeger, so that is always good. I truly just shelling each other and see just a dead body is laying around. The four men jumped off the building, who killed themselves. And he just Austin Cavalry. Oh, I saw just the impact. We're just dead all over the place. Mostly Austrian, ca Aust Austrian ca casualties. And here is the Italian force. I thought this was Kingston's army. I'm not sure about that. And here is Austrian artillery. Shelling uh, Hanover. Hanover is now setting up. No, still moving up. No, is I thought I was setting up somewhere here, and he is. I think. I moved up my oh, wrong button. I moved up my troops a little bit. Hanover is all the way up here. I'm just seeing my troops way in the back. Now even Hanover uh, Bavaria is getting shelled. French artillery is still healthy. Didn't lose a single soul. France don't really know how to react on this. And now the battle has begun. The first shots have been fired. I, I can't go in the house. Last time I could go in the house and that was quite a good view you could see. But here it's just... Also just getting killed here. On the other side, not really much to see. Only... That a Hanover is taking up a position down here. They are take, they're getting through in a hold. And setting up some defensive position. I moved up my... Uh, light Dragoons. My infantry is way at the back, still. Also, here, infantry way in the back. Austria is moving up. The house is already shooting and def oh, defending. I see in cavalry engagements, Italian cavalry and Hanover Jaekers. The uh, Hanover Jaekers broke. Good play of Italy, even though they lose their own cavalry. Hanover also forms square, and that's actually it. Here, Italian and uh, Bavarian forces start to show up. This is Kingston's artillery piece from the beginning. <laughs> uh, still, I like it that I just sniped him. What I, I didn't want to do it actually. 
Kingston, if you've, if you've seen this, this wasn't planned. Oh, the other casualties my cannon made, that was planned. My... What it is? My lands are getting shelled by the Italian artillery. Initially, the fight at the house has begun. Also, is just moving, just moving around. Bavera opened as well. All the Italian or the Austrian army, sorry, is moving up. I took a screenshot of that. I hope I have the house in the back. And go a little further. Try to get some nice screenshots down. Now it's kind of starting to get a little bit, a bit laggy. Okay, go, cool. lots of fun. Okay, I, I think I have a nice, a nice screenshot. Maybe one of those screenshots will be. Um, I lost here. Yeah. Maybe one of those screenshots will be my thumbnail for today. Uh, uh, when I upload this video, no. This Saturday, Kingston will also do his live stream, so you can check him out if you want. I heard man charging. Oh, Austin cavalry charges the French cavalry. Bavarian cavalry is coming to rescue the French. The support of range. On the other side, Hanover took up positions. Limburg the artillery. That's about it. I'm still at the back. On the other side, I start to move my troops up because Bavaria is moving their troops up. So. What's now going to happen is Hanover is just going to be more alone. I mean, I have some troops left, but I don't really do a lot with these troops. I'm more focusing now on this side of the battle. Austria is charging in with Canadiers and Chasseur, uh, Chauffeur Leguet. Austria is kind of breaking. Oh, wrong button. Nope, wrong button. I uh, won't misclick. I really, I. I think this will be really awesome. Screenshots with Bavaria in the back with forming square. I took a screenshot. Nice. On the other side, Austria, who already lost massive casualties, is now starting to open fire. You can see the shooting's already played at. Oh my god. My units. Still moving up. On the other side, still not, still nothing to see. My artillery still shelling the man you can see. The the Bavarians also start to open their own fronts.
I'm gonna open it for the guys. Oh, I think I'm in time. Austrians do a good amount of damage. A lot of prevents are breaking, but now the Austrians start to break. Oh, mm, just one, uh, one Kev, uh, one uh, horseman down. My troops are now going into line position. I can hold down here. I put up two reserve units for now, trying to hold off the Bavarian Italians to flank the Austrians. Again, guys, first time online. Not really my best move. Now we see two, two Italian units, one cavalry unit. Pretty healthy and one artillery unit. Also pretty healthy. And you can see I'm shelling the place out of them. Italian uh, general under attack, it seems like. We still have all the actions happening here. My units are setting up their position. Trying to take a folio. If they couldn't take a folio, I couldn't make a screenshot of it. Yep. Shooting into the Bavarians. Bavarians start to chew up. Hmm. I didn't do my, I didn't do good that good of a job. I'm about to get flanked myself by overwhelming Italian forces. So now I'm moving my line infantry a little further north, a uh, little further up. Down here, situations are still big chaos. Austria retreating, Bavaria retreating, sh shooting, tons of smoke, tons of artillery, shelling down. And it seems like the Austrians are were victorious. The French have retreated, but now the next battle has begun. The French are forming a square formation. Why did I click the wrong button? Because this also would be a perfect screenshot. More French cavalry is breaking. Austria doesn't really have trouble with that cavalry, but they're coming way too close to infantry. On the other side, more and more Italian Italian units are showing up. They've also taken this house, so at the moment they have two points, we have a one point. I'm still trying to shell the shit out of them with my artillery, so is Hanover. Nope, Hanover has limbered up. They can move forward, I think. Yep, they're moving forward. Now my two reserve units, I'm trying to set them up down here, so... Generally, way down here. Willem II van Oranje, way down here. But these two units are trying to get more down here so I can flank Italians to force them to back up a bit. And here is an Italian unit as well. This side is really calm. Just shelling, just shooting off some cannon shots. That's it, some cannonballs. Down here, the battle is juicy. 
stretch out line battles. A lot of chaos down here. Already in graveyards. Also in strength to attack again, breaking another performing unit. Until we're just doing fine. Austria backed off a bit and now the now Bavaria is setting up an, a charge. Here's the Bavaria in general. If they can try to take him out, it will be huge. Already 11 men. I kill like 5 of them. My units over here just doing nothing, just standing there. And when I was almost here, I suddenly saw a new line appearing. I was kind of scared on this moment, I didn't know what to do. This line is now moving up. And we get to hear that the balance of power is in favor of the of the Kingsman Alliance. But the Gimlordian Alliance won't give up. Austria is moving a bit further, trying to mirror the French movement. The French is Napoleon is still holding this you this house. Nicely done. My units are forming up and I kind of set my one unit here to get to face them and still my artillery is down here able to shell the Italians I have still tons of units here doing nothing now I'm moving up two units I don't know why I only moved up a couple of them I could move all of them up are they actually hidden? They are hidden. And now moving everything up. I've hidden units. Okay. I still have some hidden units. I didn't do that during the battle. I didn't really know where you could see if they were hidden. But uh, if you look to the unit, you have first the type of unit, and then you have uh, the statement walking, then hidden, and that means they are hidden. If not, it's just hidden is not there. Austria is kind of falling back. So the Bavaria one on this side. Now we're getting to see lots of Italian units. Hanover is going in for a cavalry charge. So is Italy. Oh. Oh the oh no they. The Jägers came back. And this is this is Hussars. All Hussars, all his uh, light cavalry. Now I'm moving over my uh, cavalry units. All the Hussars. Really good. What oh, Italy lost and lost in Dragoon unit. So now this side is also spicing up. Our men are running, sir. And my first units start to run. At this moment I was figuring out he were really starting to lose. We were just trying to get hoping we could win. My horse still is just is now in range to shell the Italians. The 
No, I'm trying to flank the Italians down here. Italy saw it and immediately trend moved this line a bit back. Hanover is just rushing through through Italian troops with his cavalry. My cavalry now got the order to attack. I only don't remember what I ordered them to attack. The Dutch still fighting. My unit came back. So I, then I noticed that I really tried to move them around and get them back fighting. Like in. Nope. I thought they were moving, no, they're just reloading. Hanover isn't losing any cavalry, just charging in. Hanover. Jaegers are still firing, so. Everything is good, and I'm charging in to take out an Italian uh, artillery. I tried to get both Italian artillery out. One unit worked. The other... I don't know if it worked, because Italian cavalry is already coming to support. I think I did it. I did it. I took out the boat Italian artillery they had. Now I'm trying to get rid of the unit of Noah charging them in. Hanover is coming to rest, is coming to support me. He's just moving up his troops, they didn't do anything yet. On this side we're trying to hold without any good without a lot of success. You see here that Austria is kind of shifting over his troops. So they have to they fight their forces. My men start to run again. Oh yeah, my cavalry is now about to die. I see one cavalry and he is my second. Both my cavalry units are gone. I'm trying to find a good spot to fight Italians. And like I see, I'm moving my try to move my troops a bit up. We're still out of range. This moment we were thinking it's gonna be hard to win. Like you see, they are still fresh. They, this Italian Austin army is still fresh. This Italian army and I were retreating. We couldn't do a lot. Hanover is just going ham. Oh, he, they lost their cavalry. I think they will come back. My artillery is still shelling them. My 12 pounder, my 10 pounder is still also still shelling them. Austin artillery. They are burnt. He is just taking nap. He's not that he's taking nap. They still be still shooting, I think. They are shooting. Because our artillery broke during the battle. They broke not, they uh, glitched during the battle. Osta is about to get flanked by Italian cavalry. Our men are running. 
more men are running of my more Dutchmen are running this entire flank broke due to uh, Bavarian cavalry nice blade I'm retreating more of my units I'm trying to hold this side but I felt really in un, uh I wasn't sure at all I was really doubting if I could do it my army broke uh, Austria is all starting to break Also, hold against the uh, Italian cavalry charge. <laughs> and here, Italy broke through. Uh, Hanover broke through. Sorry, guys, I'm going in the morning. I'm not really. I just woke up. I'm not really. Up that long. I realize I still had a line of a tree sitting here and uh, next to the excuse me, sitting next to the artillery, so I'm moving them up. Really trying to push Italians kind of back. But Austria is trying to do everything they can to hold. Bavaria. I think he's going for our artillery, I don't know. Almost my entire army broke in just a couple of seconds. 12 pounders still shooting. I had here my militia, but I forgot totally about them. They were hidden for the enemy, so they were also hidden for me. <laughs> I really forgot about them. And I forgot some uh, cavalry units back. And we are really, now we're really struggling to hold the line. Now we're thinking about we're gonna lose, we're gonna lose. And no, for just walking didn't say a lot. Actually, we totally forgot about it, about Hanover to be honest. You can see that all other Austrian army is also starting to lose men. Both Austrian arms are losing men. Uh, I'm almost out of the game. I'm trying to link this unit up with them. I started to get really in tunnel vision, so I didn't saw Hanover anymore. I saw one unit in here and I told them hey watch out there's one unit in the village and they cleared it and like I said I'm now I just see the slaughter this game this match brought I didn't saw that last time because medium difficulty bodies disappear they left the house I'm trying to get the screenshot of the death. It's really just one big grave for this battlefield. I can uh, look through all these screenshots and take the really the good ones. The ones with a lot of death. Okay, uh, the sound kind of broke, but that's not on this mod. The sounds will really break a lot. I moved from my uh, infantry. And now we start to see Hanover again. And now I was thinking maybe we can do this. I was thinking maybe we can do this because Hanover, his best units are its cavalry, artillery, and Jaegers. All the others are militia. Italy is retreating because his son 
suddenly they see uh, they see Hanover coming really close. So the Italian army who should stop them broke. I'm moving my troops up. I'm just sh just shooting this Italian unit from two different sides and they broke. The sound kind of broke. No, nobody. Is this seriously? Uh, no, yeah, they're fighting. See, you can't hear the f uh, the firing. Uh, you can't hear the gunshots, but you can't hear them march. It's just the, it's just the mod. This mod is. Not really perfect thing to say. It crashes quite. It can crash quite often. The sounds broke. Can can broke. Can break quite fast. And now Hanover is just marching his infantry towards the enemy. Don't give me shit. And now he ordered the charge. He ordered. We discovered to charge the militia of Italy. You can see us this all what remains of Austria. The Austrians that were fighting down here, that's all what remains. And the artillery. Okay, you can hear the cannon shooting. Hanover is just coming in like there's nothing here. They are just dude, coming in with ease because yeah, why would they hurry? They are all fresh units, we are all fighting. They lost tons of troops, we lost tons of troops. And now I'm trying to combine my military force. Did I take the militia? I find a militia again, so I'm moving them up, trying to combine our my force and just make one big firing line. And we got the firing fire uh, the gunshots back. Italy is doing his best to hold us off. Oh, why did Italian unit came back? Yo. That Italian unit was a pain in the ass indeed. Hanover is now just shooting the end the uh, Italy with its militia. I don't think Hanover knows these uh, hussars from Lunenburg are getting shot by some Allied infantry. So that is their papa. Okay. He's clearly just getting shot at. Oh, I think also artillery is doing things. I'm trying to hold the line. Osta is real retreating. And now the Austrian army is trying to hold up as much, tr tr trying to buy us as much time as possible. <laughs> you could see how from from how, um, how can I say this? We were retreating. We lost our hope. Hanover came in. And the tides are turning. I'm still shooting with with my man. Hanover is rushing his cavalry units in. Just one big frontal uh, attack. A mistake of Italian was not forming a square in time. In general, Italian general very close. Hanover cavalry broke. 
unfortunately. I know if uh, has still be put here, and I think he's coming on limbo. Apparently not. Oh my god, this is just a graveyard. This entire battle, I like it. <laughs> this also I did pay a lot of attention because it just, yeah, this is the battle kinda. It's gonna move back and forward. On this side, Hanover came in and the entire battle has turned. Ital this Italian army is trying to buy some buy some time for the ally. Bavaria is I think oh no. I thought they were out of the game, they are trying to form up here as well. I'm starting to flank some Italian units. I'm now with these units I kinda hold on the match. I brought some units back to break them again and now just marching them back. Hanover is just helping us a lot. With one of with one or two line infantry units. Rivera is setting up his man down here, trying to do it as much effort to try to get us out of the match, but Hanover insurance are fresh. They didn't saw any action. Now is the time to shine. And Hanover went in for a melee charge and he sends in his cavalry. And he is breaking Italian after Italian after Italian. It's Hanover, one big militia force, and he's kind of saving and he's saving our ass. It was really very fun to see. This house, nobody claims it. But for the moment, it's in, it, in uh, enemy hands, in Kingsman hands. But the Game Lordens are coming back. Now I'm moving my troops up, who are gonna sit there next there and gonna open fire on the Italians. Austria is gonna try to hold this those French units. Our artillery is broken. There are some friendly fire. Now Hanover is taking on Bavarian troops. Oh, all the blood in the screen. Smart move from it from Hanover to just from square. He eliminated his artillery. And Hanover broke Bavarian cavalry. You can see all those shooting, all those Italian break. Bavaria, Ital one Italian army is out of the match. Bavaria is almost out of the match. We have one Austrian army is almost out of the match. Still, my militia force is coming up. My artillery has is broken, is glitched out. They are able to fire normally. No one there would be able to fire, but they don't. My horse artillery has broke. They are really able to shoot them, but they broke.
retreating Austrians and Napoleon is just watching the enemy. Here comes the Austrian general. Austria is trying to do everything to save, save his last man. I'm even moving up my uh, general. And just like that, it, one Italian army broke, Italy is now trying to hold us. Hanover is just still walking like nothing is happening. Oh my god, this really is just one big graveyard. They are really coming. <laughs> they like it close, they like it personal. And over the and over really like it personal. And another melee charge. Okay, uh, ladies and gentlemen, my game crashed, so we're kind of back at the point, my where we that we were. So, Hanover just arrived. I don't know if the sound is really loud enough. I can turn it back a little bit louder. Uh, I've put the sound a little louder. Poland, uh, Hanover just arrived and is helping against Italy. I'm reforming my line to attack Italy from the other side and trying to get. Well, my plan was actually to support uh, Austria as well, but Austria is in full retreat. Um, this give charge is Austria against oh the general of Bavaria, but they didn't kill him. And he has some other calf to rescue. And some artillery. I even think there was friendly fire. It was more friendly fire than none. Than enemy killed, I think. <clears throat> but on this side, the French and Austrians still just lining up and fighting each other Ooh, Francis has called a retreat nice very nice the fight at the house is kind of over it's just more down here the French and one Bavarian unit Uh, maybe I have to say that during the this game when Hanover start the cavalry charge down here, uh, one player, one Italian player broke. Uh, gr the game of him crashed, so he excuse me, he left the game. <clears throat> um, so this is Kingston's army, and. Is this the game? Uh, this is the player who's still in. This is just AI. But still, the AI put up a hard fight. He, yeah, we would probably have. We would probably lose if the arm or the army or the player still was in here. Oh, it's hard to speak English today. Uh, 
At the moment, Italy and Bavaria are trying to retreat, set up a defensive line. I'm taking some screenshots because not because we're playing on uh, medium difficulty. The bodies disappeared and the smoke wasn't there, so it now it looks really epic. During the game, during the during play, during the live stream, it wasn't. I know if uh, he's still just marching in. Even though Henov is already fully committed to the fight, and you see it's AI, but it, that doesn't matter, it's still an epic fight to the end. <clears throat> I made some mistakes because Kingston retreated quite far, I didn't really move up, I just stood here. I could move more armies just up and try to face them. I really hate the Dutch flag. It could be so much more, but they didn't. And still, Hanover is rolling in. Are they gonna do? They gonna shoot? They gonna open up fire just in this unit? I think. Yeah. I don't know on which unit they are shooting, but here's. One unit that's getting obliterated by my by my forces. There is some Italian unit still resisting, but because it's carefully recharged, it's all over. Uh, the left flank of the Italian Bavarian force is moving up, trying to. Get them down. Italy is moving up the last cavalry, just like Bavaria. Another side. It's still just a line battle. Man, yeah, just it's a line battle in full swing. This is and was a bloody battle. Remember, we were playing with thought this, this had to be a bloody battle. And it definitely is. Bavaria went for the artillery. Bavaria went for the artillery but didn't finish the job. Now some infantry is forming square. I remember Hanover is all just a uh, militia. Here are the uh, Hanoverian Hanoverian uh, cavalry, and they're gonna uh, they're gonna just kill this unit. It's gonna they're gonna wipe out the unit properly. Italy still want to strike with their cavalry. Bavaria trying to do everything to break uh, Hanover but fails. One Ital Italian army is out. They totally broke. So now we're fighting against. So now we're actually even. This is one uh, Austrian army. This is one Austrian army, and then we have Hanover and me, the Dutch. And Bavaria is almost touched, so it's almost in 2v4. Well, 3v3 actually. Because this Austrian army isn't really. It's not really much. Uh, Hanoverian infantry broke Italian cavalry. Hmm. Ooh, 
Oh, the artillery is firing danger close. I hope he noticed. I don't think so. Oh, he killed a bunch of his own men. Oh. He's killing a tense. Now he's just actually the last tent of Austria. Artillery firing down the French and one Italian unit. My artillery do nothing. Really do nothing, even though they could fire on these Italians. I think they are out of range, I'm not sure. I still have my general up here. And my 12 pounder. And I'm moving up one militia. Yep. One militia and my 12 pounder is doing nothing. And just... We were fighting a couple of minutes. If we're gonna, if we, if this was one straight up recording, a couple of minutes ago, you could still see it. We were fighting down here. Now we're already here. We broke one army. The second army is about to get killed. One of our armies is getting about getting killed, and we're getting some control back. Now it's really kind of even. And I think we were... Oh, this was the spot we were. Hanover coming up real close towards... Italy. It seems kind of laggy to me, I'm not sure. Oh, Hanover goes in for charge. I'm not sh Oh, artillery. This artillery is not firing on them. Oh, Bavar some Bavarian units came back. Yeah, it can be that my video is now kind of laggy. Um, I, I had some school today, so I'm just recording this when my school ended. Is over, and I'm uh, so my computer is very, very hot, and I'm still trying to get my record book game burning as smooth as possible. There is some artillery down here, but I don't see from. No, this artillery is still shooting on the Austrians down here. Hanover is just going. Hanover started to break, but they made great progress. Hanover is breaking. Uh, the less Italian army, Kingston, is breaking. Really, there is some artillery shooting. I think the artillery is standing here. I think, I'm not sure. I think it's a uh, Hanover is going in for one final charge. No, they're going to shoot at the enemy. It appears. It's really warm. I hope my computer will hold out. And the Dutch start to break again. Wait. 
Oh yeah, my TV broke. And here's my general. Try I tried to charge him in, but they would charge me and I would get a bonus. They would kill my general and my last man will lose morale. And that will cause me to break. So I re so I, I pulled my general back. Let's actually Ostra face him. Yeah, Ostra, we have still some units. Six units of Ostra, no artillery left. Artillery at this point was broke. <laughs> it's... Yeah. <laughs> I don't think it's its own artillery. I hope it's not. Hanover broke Bavaria. France is retreating. So, Austria was victorious. Now everything will come to the last man. Oh, real point blank rage. And now they're gonna go in for a charge. Oh my god. There was a point blank rage. Yeah, some Bavarian artillery is shelling the Hanoverian. Hanovers? Hanoverians? But at the moment I saw the Bavarian artillery shooting at Hanover and I asked to the last remaining Austrians Hey, could you try to take out that um, Bavarian artillery so it stops shelling our position? I don't know when I said it because it's really like Oh look, we have artillery looking back, oh look it's a Bavarian Hey Austria, can you do something about it? And then I was just going back to my battle. Um, Italy is put up the last retreat. I'm about to follow them. Austria is coming towards us, but there are still four French regiments. Oh, that's my general. I thought maybe I had some units. No, all my fighting units are here. And just like this, Hanover is out. So Hanover did actually one big suicide charge, and that saved us today. And now Austria is just all in for that artillery, so I think I just said it. I said it uh, four or five seconds ago because all of last Austrian is going to be French appearing out of the out of nothing. <laughs> French is retreating, he's thinking let Bavaria take it. And I dispatched these units to fight off the French. And just for a moment. I think it's yeah, from this moment somebody says, hey, you don't need six units, yeah, with three will be will be good. Uh, yeah, I wasn't really. But France is trying to flank us. Hanover is trying to get Italy out. I'm just following, hoping to get some shots off as well. Austria is coming closer. Oh, the Howitz is still active. Yeah, our Howitz is still active. Oh, this shockwave is sub. But when the explosion happened, the shockwave. Italy is, is at the house. Just looking at the house. Italy is 
trying to slow the Hanover Hano by sa sacrificing one or two units. Not that bad. Austria is flanking them. And I saw the French coming in. From the flank, so I sent my units over, try to protect the flank of Hanover. So Hanover could go full on on Italy. And they're still in the French artillery, shelling Hanover. I have to say, well placed, even well placed artillery. I want to say infantry, but it's not really infantry. So now you can see France divide himself in two. I think one army is... I don't know what this part of the army will do. This is just so they can't flank Italy. But this force, I don't know. I think they are just retreating because they are getting overwhelmed. And not by a bit. No, they can hold here. Get the first volley off, okay. And now I'm starting to, to deploy my alliance. It seems like. Hanover is really doing the, the best he can. Three of my units are still uh, preserving those three French units. The French have split their forces now in two again. One is firing against uh, Hanover, trying not to get uh, fi back fired from behind. And they are also men facing me. Oh, he ripped through my lines. My line infantry. And the Belgian standing proud, firing down on the French. Oh, also is going in for a charge. I think he took out a. Uh, Artillery, they did, I think. No, wait, they are coming back. Is another unit going in? Yeah, another unit is going in. Oh my god, it's actually real beautiful at the end. Hanover is now out of the game. He has some scattered units around, so is Bavaria. And so is us. No, Austria has some force down here. He's still in. Now, actually, this is the last defense of the enemy. Oh, epic clash between France and Hanover. France is trying to send in more reinforcements and I'm still firing at their backs. They broke Hanover, but we're still fighting on every. We're still making mass casualties at their side. They are starting to break slowly. At this point, I dropped two units trying to support 
let's try to fight this unit. And these units, I let them rest for a bit. Apparently, I thought I moved them up. I didn't. Austria is taking on Italy. Yeah, Italy is not doing that good. That good, like in the beginning. The French army broke, so now I'm gonna go behind Italy, trying to get some kills. Now I'm moving my forces to fight off the French. So now they're surrounded by the Austrians in the back and me at the front. More Italians are breaking. So now Italy is like, okay, I can't take a uh, shelter in the house, I'm gonna claim this house. Especially because it's based on my two units coming. One Italian unit is breaking. Oh, beautiful. They're just getting shot at. Even the generals is, is taking put, taking shelter in the house. I think I thought it was. Yeah, even the general is getting into the house. <laughs> He's dead desperate. I got one unit. Oh, that's my general. Never mind. Yeah, we know he's gonna win now. There's no doubt. So I couldn't just fast forward a bit. General is running in front of the house, trying to get in. I'm shooting at the house. Austria shooting at the house. Italy's trying to defend it. France is slowly breaking. And, but we can't forget the man of the hill. And I forget we, I was fighting down. Oh, I was. I forgot I fought uphill, so my men were breaking. I thought, how could they defeat me? I outnumbered them. Yeah, but they are on the fighting uphill. Okay, I. Okay, I thought my game would crash again. So Hanover is still running around with some units? Actually, quite some units. France broke totally on here, so these are the three last French troops. Italy is in this house with his general. Austria is about. Uh, we're wiped the units out. Uh, Italy is just doing a last defense. And now I'm moving off my Canadier. My Canadiers, my Belgian Canadiers. I'm moving them over because Canadiers are having really good melee status. Stats. Of the seven horses that stood here, only three survived. Epic less defense in the house. Actually, really, really epic. Oh, it's getting laggy. You need to stay moving for in fast forward speed, otherwise your game will start to lag. My Canadiers, where are they? They are in... No, they are still here. Here are my Belgian Canadiers. Italy had some... U one unit coming back. 
It's an icon uh, surprise. Uh, Austria. Hey. I want to down it. Especially by his artillery. <laughs> they lost the volley, but they broke. Mayans appeal start to break as well, especially through melee charge. The melee charge failed. Now France moving up. Is going for melee charge or we positioning? France is repositioning and trying to get a volley on me. There are some raiding units who came back, but it, it's not much. Now I'm even moving my entire force over. <laughs> I want to take a screenshot of this. Give me a moment. And we can fan and we can fast forward again. The AI is about to yeah, all the AI sides are all players, all just knowing what's going to happen. And Austria is going in. With German line infantry. Am I going as well? Well, line infantry, Belgische jagers, Belgische grenadieren. I'm not moving up my grenadiers. Even though I could, they are active. Nederlandse grenadieren, maar. I took Canadiers. Actually, I now I'm moving them in. Okay, my Dutch Canadiers and my Belgian Canadiers both are moving up, but there wasn't enough plays in there. I need one melee charge. Try yeah, I need one melee charge trying to break them, but I broke my own man. Uh, it's militia and Kingston's uh, general died. If I may see it, if I may see it, Kingston's general died on the balcony. Not on the balcony. He's. General died fighting inside the house, trying to save his own bodyguard's life. He died with honor. <laughs> but that will wrap up the bet for the day. This new French unit will be broken. Hope we took the house. Uh, here's the Austrian general taking the other house. So we have three points. These two French units will get wiped out, so battle is over. I will see you at the result at the end when when we have the scoreboard. Okay, um, I'm just looking and I see this French unit uh, following my militia and their name, Laurent Saint Chance. And Laurent, I don't know what that means, but I know Saint Chance means without luck, without chance. The fuck? That is not a good name to have. <laughs> and we're at the end. Hanover was moving up his general, so was I. So Hanover was charging and I said, hey, uh, I'm charging him as well. Let me charge him and flank him. And, flank him. and you see Hanover is doing that. Uh, the enemy were all watching at this unit and they saw Hanover just one ran just past him and they were like, what the fuck is Hanover doing? And now they saw my general coming. I had some units, but this was the last. Hanover is now turning around. This unit is ready to open a volley. Shoots some, sh loses one, drops one volley on my channel, kills one. 
And here is uh, Hanover's general. And here comes my general at the end to finish it off. And that was the battle. It was a bloody one, but fun to play. It's. Oh, it's really fun to do it. It was really fun to play this. It really was. So, these are the end results. And to give you a real thing, these are all men, all subscribers of Kingston. Uh, Chain, I don't know if he was in, he's a sub or not. Because he was. I always throw my cell phone from my desk. But Jane is from the new player uh, league of Napoleon Total War 3. I will leave a link to the Discord uh, to the Discord of the NPL new player league down in the description below. I can also I can one also say that Kings is gonna stream uh, uh, he's about to stream weekly every Saturday. So expect uh, you can expect from me a weekly series on Sunday or Monday. One of the Tuesdays I will upload one battle replay from the live stream. So I want to thank Kingston for doing this um, uh, for the stream and letting me join. And for everybody else, it's a king. It's a Kingsman, it's a Kingsman, it's Kingsman. <laughs> Game Lordian, this also Kingsman, this is Kingston. Kingsman, Kingsman, and an NPL player. Uh, I want to thank you all, every seven of you. It was a great battle, had great fun. And I hope we can do it this weekend again. So, if you also want, so if you want to become like this man, this man if you want to be a Kingston for me, so and game game lordian be sure to hit the subscribe button because when we hit the 50 subs it will be a you will become a game lordian i hope you liked the video too if you did hit the like button so be sure to subscribe hit the bell notification to stay up to date and i hope i see you next time bye bye